Hey gorgeous soul, welcome to your monthly October astrology. This month, the film's a little bit different. I'm taking you on a journey through the magical and surreal Faroe Islands and uh, you can share the wonder of the Faroe Islands while we talk about the wonder of October. It's passionate, it's full of intrigue and it's all about balance and power. Here's your monthly astrology. Hi, fabulous Gemini. This month, the energy is all about looking at your patterns, looking at your physical health, actually, your health and well-being, your mental, emotional, spiritual and sensual well-being, but also working really hard to transform, not even working hard, you're going to feel like changing patterns. Your focus is on decluttering your life and making your life a healthier space. It's about your routine and your habits, your day-to-day living and your work. So all of that is quite intense, but it, you you know, if you do the work, you should get huge rewards right now and through the whole of the month. So, you know, often if we try and change patterns or work out or do something or change our health re- regime, it, sometimes it works and sometimes it's difficult. This month you're being helped by the cosmos to shift negative patterns and move on. Pluto is also going direct on the the third, thank goodness. You may have felt that you're dealing with really difficult and dark times from your past and you've been kind of maybe worried about things or, or feeling the shadows of the past haunt you. But right now, it's about stepping into your power. The past is moving away and you're stepping into your future power. Mercury is going into your health and well-being habit changing mode. You're very, very on it when it comes to work and taking care of the details. I have to say, though, Mars is giving you a helping boost because Mars is going into your passion, lust, joy and happiness mode. So you're feeling super frisky, super sensual. Um, Also, you want to sort of do things that are fun, dancing, music, anything that gets you sort of, you know, laughing and moving is good for you this month. But it's it's a very happy place to be, for Mars to be there. It's exciting and it's uh, fulfilling. Although, to be honest, with Venus going into your health and well-being and habit zone, you're not necessarily, you know, you want everything to be ordered and everything to be good. You want relationships to be stable. You want to put the work in, but you will find it very difficult if you're in a relationship and they don't put the work in. If you're single, you're going to be attracted to the hardworking, diligent types. And if you're not into relationships in general, you will be putting all of your love into changing your routines, changing everything in your life so that it it works for you. Now, we do have a lovely, lots of lovely things going on, but let's talk about the full moon. The full moon is connecting you with people. So if you get a chance to go out or there's something you want to launch online or anything to do with um, social media, a great day for you is the 13th UK time because people are very receptive to what you've got to say and you're, it's a great day for networking and linking up with the right people. And also on the 14th, the sun is sextile Jupiter. Oh my goodness, and it's such a great place for you. You're feeling like your heart is opening. You're meeting people and you're around people that really get you and you're, you should be feeling the love mid-month. Towards the end of the month, the sun and a new moon in your health and well-being zone are giving you the power and the incentive to change those habits and do the work on yourself. And also you've got the physical energy and the desire to do physical work as well as, you know, sort out any tasks that you haven't handled before. We end the month with Mercury and Venus um, in that zone. You're feeling open hearted. You're feeling loving. And you might find yourself doing some work that's giving back in some way. Take care, gorgeous soul, and I'll speak to you soon.